Banished from Earth Classic Game Room broadcasts from the Intergalactic Space Arcade on its never-ending mission to review everything. Welcome to Classic Game Room, what happens when you make the Nintendo 3DS even bigger? And a lot better, you get the Nintendo 3DS XL, where the XL stands for extra lovin'. Yes, it does. And if it doesn't, it should. This is the original black Nintendo 3DS with an analog interactive sticker on it. This is the Nintendo 3DS XL without an analog interactive sticker. They make wooden Neo Geos, but Nintendo makes the 3DS XL, which is the superior Nintendo 3DS. Frankly, it's the one they should have come out with the first time. While my original 3DS works, it's fingerprinted, the headphone jack is now broken, the battery life sucks. All of these things seem to have been addressed with the new one, which has a matte finish that doesn't show fingerprints, it has a better battery, and the screens are enormous! Also, the headphone jack works, but that may have been an isolated incident. Now, this is actually Brandon's Nintendo 3DS XL from Classic Game Room, and he's into Animal Crossing and walks around talking to himself and muttering strange things about his animal friends. I don't know, I've never played it. But after spending time with his 3DS XL and going through his personal information and deleting game files, I've decided I really like the 3DS XL, and you can get this in a variety of colors and special editions, like the Mario and Luigi one, as well as the Zelda model. In every way, this is a superior 3DS. Better fit and finish, it feels nicer, it looks better. It has the 3D slider that can also do 2D, and 3D camera. Wow, Brandon's taken a lot of steps, usually running away from me when I ask him to play in television baseball or something. Anyway, as we dig through his personal information here, let's check out some of the other features like the camera, which works pretty much the same as the other one, except with a bigger screen and more drive space. But most importantly, the 3DS is about the games, because there's a lot of them, and when the screens are bigger, the games are better. Except this is still not compatible with Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, or Atari 2600. It does play Nintendo DS games, though. So here's how this works, you insert a Nintendo 3DS game or DS game or download one from their eShop and play it using the buttons and the D-pad and the little analog thumbstick thing. The size of the 3DS fits my hands better. It still has a touch screen which is now bigger and the screen is easily twice as good. It's a lot bigger and it's just better. Another feature to consider is the price of the 3DS XL which is pretty good these days and it's probably only getting cheaper depending on which model you buy. Front Mission always looks better with a giant screen. There's just thousands of games to choose from across the 3DS, DS, and Nintendo eShop and Virtual Console. You can even play Metroid, but I would not recommend trying to play Metroid and Altered Beast at the same time. That just doesn't work at all. Fortunately, the 3DS XL does. Where the XL stands for extra loving. You still get Wi-Fi, you get 3D, bigger screens, longer battery, more storage, backup, data, thing, and piles of games that also fits in your pocket. It's the Nintendo 3DS. XL. I gotta be honest, I really like the Nintendo 3DS XL so much so that I don't want to give this back to Brandon, and I can't give him back my standard Nintendo 3DS because Altered Beast is on here, so... What handheld game system should I give to Brandon in return? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Hey, Brandon. Hey, hey I'm bringing back your Nintendo 3DS oh, XL. Boy, you're the hey, best. Uh, hey, thanks a lot. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Oh, can I have yeah. the batteries out of that, by the way? Here's your copy of Animal Crossing back. Oh, thanks. I raised it. Oh. Can I swear? Yes. Mm -hmm. Double the flavor. How don't these fit? Oh. That's good. Thanks, man. You're the best. Yeah.